Hi there, welcome everyone. It's me, Lori Lytle, Inner Goddess Tarot. So welcome to another Tarot Tuesday. Let's take a look at what's in the cards for the week of October 24th, 2017. As always, I appear here and on Facebook and via my newsletter on Tuesdays to provide some mystical yet practical guidance to help you hit the ground running each week. So I'm here with my cards to give you some insight and illumination into what you need to know or what you need to be aware of, where you need to focus your energy to help you make the most of the upcoming days ahead, the upcoming week ahead. So take a moment, take a breath. Okay. Give yourself a little bit of a quiet moment there and tell me. You know, which card is calling to you? Is it one, two, or three? Hmm. Okay. And before I reveal these three cards, I ask you to hold on to your hats, my dears. These are some big cards this week. They seem to build in intensity as we go through one, two, three. So there's an opportunity this week for getting back to your center, for understanding your purpose a little bit better, and to start to create your own unique and wonderful place in the world. So I felt really overwhelmed and happy when I saw these cards. I feel like there's something big going on. There's the opportunity this week for big personal shifts. So let's see how the cards can help us achieve that. Okay, so did you choose the first card, number one? Oh, it's lovely, the star. She's been coming up a lot lately for me, and here she is again. So here we have a gentle healing energy, the calm after the storm. If you've been going through a difficult time, let the light of the star rekindle a feeling of hope, faith, and optimism. Open your heart and share your gifts generously. Be the star of your own life story. Let your own true light shine. There's no need to hide anything. Pretend to be different than you are. Just let your light shine. Release your fears and doubts. You are on the right track. Okay. So did you choose the second card, number two? Judgment. Feeling listless? This is your wake-up call. Judgment urges you to identify your true calling, to follow your passion. This is a good day and a good week ahead for some personal reflection. It's time to let the past be past and move forward with a feeling of lightness and rejuvenation. A major project or milestone is heading towards completion. So it's not a card of letting go of the past, but, you know, kind of reconciling with it, drawing a line under it and moving forward, feeling new and reborn, full of purpose. Okay, so did you choose number three? The world. Things are coming full circle. The many aspects of your life are coming together in beautiful harmony. You are nearing a time of transformation. As this cycle ends, another is about to begin. Pause, appreciate, and celebrate your accomplishments, and get ready to move forward. Know yourself. Use this knowledge to create a structure for yourself that provides support and security, and yet still allows you to dance freely within it. So this week, I invite you to ask yourself some big questions, but ask them joyfully. Who are you when you are just you on your own? Where do you feel the most at home in the world? What is your higher calling? So this is a week when you might get some whispers, some answers to these very big questions. And as I say, ask them joyfully, anticipating an answer that will bring you great happiness and illumination. 
Great. Thanks for watching. Um, as always, you can find me at innergoddesstarot.com and on Facebook as Inner Goddess Tarot. I post uh, Tarot Tuesdays each week on Facebook. And also, if you sign up for my newsletter on my website, then you can receive uh, Tarot Tuesday right to your inbox. So thanks. Wishing you a magical week ahead. Bye.